I've been during this month, April uh, 2021, um, in Fundación Miro in different weeks. Uh, one of the weeks I was um, recording with eight dancers and myself uh, some material that soon will become an installation for the permanent collection in Fundación Miro. It kind of plays in some ideas that I already had on, on some sort of ghost dance or some sort of bringing dance as an absence into the museum and to see how that absence can change the feeling of space or time to the visitor. And we did the recording in three separate days and it was also very inspiring to be able to see all these dancers with their singularities and their ways of being with movement, uh, their ways of moving and being moved, and the relations they were establishing with architecture or with the paintings or with the space or with the sense of rhythm. And, and I thought that was indeed very inspiring and it actually, it was also like somatically very powerful. I was very moved by all these people moving and their contributions. Um, these people were Vivian Frederick, Georgia Bardaru, Rosa Muñoz, Juni Sun, Dante Murillo, Anabela Pareja Robinson, Sonia Sanchez, and Carol Galindo. And they come from different backgrounds, they relate to dance in different ways, and I thought it was very nice to be able to share space together and to see each other moving and sharing our impressions also and our experience of the empty museum. In relation to that, I have also written um, a text based on the conversations I've had with each of them. And also we created a document that kind of answers some sort of like, it attempts some sort of definition of what the empty museum could be. And, and as I've said, it has been very powerful to be sharing with all these people and their ways of relating to the body in the museum.